The dark web is dangerous and potentially illegal. This is for education only. Now, let's explore the 10 most secret browsers for the hidden internet. First up, let's talk about the king of anonymous browsing, Tor Browser. If you've ever wondered how people stay truly private online, this is usually where their journey begins. Tor is completely open source, which means its code is available for anyone to inspect, modify, or improve. This transparency is a huge reason why it's trusted by millions of users worldwide, from everyday people to cybersecurity experts. When you use Tor, you're relying on a tool that's constantly being reviewed and updated by a global community. What makes Tor unique is how it anonymizes your internet traffic. Instead of sending your data directly to its destination, Tor bounces it through a random series of volunteer-run servers called nodes all around the world. Each time your data passes through a node, it's wrapped in another layer of encryption, just like peeling an onion, which is where Tor gets its name, the Onion Router. Here's the clever part. Each server in the chain only knows the location of the previous and next node, but never the entire path. This means no single point in the network can trace your activity all the way back to you, making it extremely difficult for anyone to monitor your browsing habits. The final server in the chain, known as the exit node, is the one that actually connects to the website you're visiting. But even then, the exit node never knows who you are or where you started from. Your identity remains hidden throughout the process. Tor's massive, ever-growing network means there are countless possible paths for your data to travel. This makes it nearly impossible to single you out, helping you blend in with millions of other users. The more people use Tor, the stronger and more anonymous the network becomes. Of course, there's a trade-off. Because your data is bouncing through so many different servers, Tor can be noticeably slower than regular browsers. Websites may take longer to load, and streaming high-definition videos is usually out of the question. But for many, the privacy is worth the wait. Another advantage of Tor's popularity is that it attracts the attention of security experts worldwide. This means vulnerabilities are often found and fixed quickly, keeping the browser as secure as possible. Tor acts as digital camouflage for anyone who needs to keep their online activity private. Journalists reporting from hostile regions, activists organizing under surveillance, or simply anyone who values their privacy in an age of constant tracking. But remember, Tor isn't a magic shield. It can't protect you from every threat. Next up, let's talk about Brave, a mainstream browser that's built from the ground up with privacy in mind. Brave has quickly become a favorite for those who want a safer, more private browsing experience without sacrificing speed or convenience. By default, Brave blocks ads and trackers, so you're not constantly being followed around the web. It's also open source, which means anyone can inspect the code for transparency and security, giving users extra peace of mind. But what really sets Brave apart is its killer feature, the private window with Tor. This option lets you tap into the power of the Tor network directly from Brave, adding an extra layer of anonymity to your browsing. With just a couple of clicks, you can access Tor's powerful anonymity features, all within Brave's familiar and user-friendly interface. No complicated setup, no technical know-how required. This makes Brave perfect for anyone who finds the traditional Tor browser intimidating or confusing to set up. It lowers the barrier to entry for private browsing, making advanced privacy tools accessible to everyone. Of course, it's important to note that Brave's Tor integration isn't quite as secure as using the dedicated Tor browser itself. Tor's own browser is more hardened and designed specifically for maximum anonymity. Still, Brave makes private browsing much more accessible, especially for people living in regions with heavy internet censorship or surveillance. It's a practical solution for everyday privacy needs. Brave strikes a great balance between usability and privacy, offering features that protect you without making things complicated. Heard of I2P? It's a parallel dark web, an anonymous network within a network. I2P uses garlic routing, bundling messages for extra privacy. The I2P browser, usually a pre-configured Firefox, gives you access to hidden EAP sites and services exclusive to I2P. It's optimized for anonymous file sharing, messaging, and blogging inside its own ecosystem. Tor is best for accessing the regular web anonymously. I2P shines as its own private internet. If you want to explore a hidden world with its own community, I2P is your ticket. It's the road less traveled in online anonymity.
Honix isn't just a browser, it's a fortress designed from the ground up to protect your privacy and security online. Imagine a digital stronghold where every layer is built to keep intruders out and your identity safe within. Honix operates using two separate virtual machines. One acts as the gateway, connecting exclusively to the Tor network, while the other is your isolated workstation where you do your actual work. This separation means your activities are shielded and your real IP address is never exposed no matter what you do. Even if malware somehow manages to compromise your browser or applications, your true location and identity remain hidden behind multiple layers of protection. Attackers hit a wall. They can't reach your real system or trace your digital footsteps. Honix is built on the rock-solid foundation of Debian Linux. It's fully open source, meaning anyone can inspect the code for vulnerabilities, and it's hardened with extra security features to withstand even advanced threats. Setting up Honix isn't as simple as installing a regular app. You'll need virtualization software like VirtualBox or KVM, and a bit of technical know-how to get everything running smoothly. But the extra effort pays off in peace of mind. For journalists, whistleblowers, activists, or anyone who faces real risks online, Hoonix offers a level of protection that's hard to match. It's trusted by those who need to keep their sources and communications absolutely confidential. Think of Honix as more than just a tool. It's a digital safe room, a place where your sensitive work and private information are locked away from prying eyes. Tails is the ultimate spy gadget, an entire operating system on a USB stick. Plug it in, boot up, and you're running a secure amnesic OS with Tor pre-installed. Tails leaves no trace. Everything runs in RAM and vanishes when you shut down. It's trusted by privacy advocates worldwide, including Edward Snowden. Perfect for using untrusted computers libraries, cafes, anywhere. Downsides? It forgets everything unless you set up encrypted storage. Tails is for moments when you absolutely cannot leave a trace. It's privacy on the go for when you need to disappear. Subgraph OS brings Assume Breach security to browsing. Its browser is a hardened, sandboxed version of Tor browser. Each tab is isolated, so attacks are contained. Open source and transparent, Subgraph invites scrutiny from security experts. The full OS is still in development, but the browser's defense layers are influential. It's not just about encryption, it's about surviving direct attacks. Subgraph's browser is a digital warrior for hostile environments. If you want proactive defense, this is your tool. It's security, built for battle. Waterfox is a privacy-focused fork of Firefox, stripping out telemetry, sponsored content, and bloat. It's open source, fast, and compatible with most Firefox add-ons. No Tor integration, but you can configure it for privacy with the right setup. Waterfox is for users who want control and a clean browsing experience. It's a rebellion against data-hungry browsers. If you want to build your own privacy setup from scratch, start here. It's simple, fast, and respects your privacy. LibreWolf is a privacy revolution. Another Firefox fork, but even more locked down. No telemetry, pre-installed ad blocker, and anti-fingerprinting features. It clears cookies on exit and blends your user agent for anonymity. Open source and community-driven, LibreWolf is transparent and secure. No built-in tour, but it's a hardened base for privacy on the regular web. For those who want privacy out of the box, LibreWolf delivers. It's always on high alert, no tweaking required. Modern, usable, and uncompromising on privacy. On Epic Privacy Browser is built on Chromium but strips out Google tracking. It blocks ads, trackers, and doesn't save your history. Its standout feature, a one-click encrypted proxy like a built-in VPN. The catch? Epic isn't fully open source. Some code is private, which raises trust issues. You're trusting the company, not a decentralized network like Tor. For everyday privacy, Epic is fast and convenient, but for maximum trust and transparency, open source options are better. Epic is privacy for the mainstream with a few caveats. Need Tor on your iPhone? Onion Browser is the answer. Free, open source, and endorsed by the Tor project, it tunnels your traffic through Tor on iOS. Access .onion sites and regular web pages anonymously from your phone. Features like easy IP switching and cookie clearing give you control. It's a huge achievement given Apple's restrictions. 
Slower than Safari, but essential for mobile privacy. Onion Browser brings the power of Tor to your pocket. That's 10 powerful open source tools for exploring the hidden internet. Use this knowledge wisely and legally. Privacy is a right, but responsibility is key. Let me know in the comments which browser blew your mind, and don't forget to subscribe for more wild tech deep dives. Stay curious, stay safe,